All right, we have Carrot versus uh, Noid Respect. Ken versus Mega Man. It's a matchup they've uh, played quite a few times now at PogChamp. Uh, the stakes are a bit higher now, though, with London invading PogChamp this week. So, you know, one of them could face Tawny Nerves. So, I'd say who's going to win this one. Uh, but with rec Ken's recent buffs, actually, uh, I think Carrot's definitely going to feel a bit more confident with, like, Down Smash, for example, comboing into other moves, Side B having the invincibility. You know, it gives, uh, it doesn't make the matchup any, like, it doesn't make it, like, you know, more side of tools one person. It makes it just a tiny bit harder. For example, um, some moves that uh, Reese might try to bring out now, Side B could just protect him. But, doesn't seem to phase him, he's got a bit of a lead right now. As I say that, he's down. Up B. Near E, yep, up B takes it. So we're seeing now Reese definitely just wants to get rid of Carrot as fast as he can. Nearly go going for the RP, trying to build up that damage, but it just misses. Had it gone a bit further, uh, Ken might have SD. So it was a good, impressive combo. Got him up to 40%. Uh, yeah, Carrot knows his uh, combos, but you know, just in case Ken doesn't work for this matchup, he always has snakes to rely on, as we saw last time when he went uh, against Ruben. Nearly getting the shield break, but the last hit just not landing. I'll be not getting the kill, never mind. I feel like um, that was a low percent though when he got the kill. I think it was like 70% when he got the little kill last time. Now it's 90, he just doesn't get it. But getting it now, definitely. Reese definitely finding this matchup a bit of a challenge right now. Um, I'm not going to say it's because of the buffs, because the buffs definitely didn't make like Ken a top tier character, but it's definitely proving to be quite useful. Uh, we've seen Reese now just take a stock, so he's not completely out. He's going to keep him away with the up airs to just cr try to keep him in disadvantage, because Ken's weakest point is when he's being juggled, and we've seen Mega Man is impressive at juggling. The up air can get early kills. And uh, Reese in general just knows what to do with these moves. He's a Mega Man Specialist, uh, having a love for the game itself. Nearly SDing with an air dodge, but just managed to make it back. Does upbeat? Nope, no upbeat out there. Nearly brought out. Accidentally does the side B, so getting rid of one of the stocks, making it closer for Reese to pick this game back up. Using the, the leaf shield to protect himself and build up a bit of damage on Ken. Because an up will take this. Impressive, an impressive set. Uh, Carrot was definitely dominating that match. Uh, second stock, he made the mistake on the side B, but other than that, he was very confident in his play. So game two, Reese is going to have to pick up on his weaknesses or any mistakes that Carrot's making to get uh, to get this set back. How are we doing, fellas? We're good. Joining the commentary is GP, sat in winner semis. GP himself, the former Ike champion. Now the Roy champion, because I'm sat in winner semis using Roy. Are you? Yeah, yeah, I beat, uh, beat Carnage. Once my phone loads. Okay, do you not believe me? I'm just looking anyway, because <laughs> you've had, some, yeah, weird, anyway, you've had so some weird losses. Yeah, that's true. Oh, 2-1, that's impressive. Yeah. But, um... But yeah, no, this is this is a Pog classic matchup. Uh, Carrot and Reese. Pretty much see it every week. You, you see it all the time. Me, you know, these two and myself and Jackson when he was a more regular attendee. All the goddamn time. All the goddamn time. 
to be fair though, when they used Ooh. to play, wasn't it Snake as well? Yeah, he played Snake a bit, but he's been playing Ken for a little while now. You say a little while, but he's like the best show in the UK. Easy, easy. <laughs> yeah, Reese seems to, uh, like he's struggling a bit here. Game one, um, Karen might have got two stock. I had not done that mistake on his second stock. Yeah, I don't want. I don't mean to jump for my guy, but Reese is definitely mad ill today. <laughs> so oh really? He, yeah, yeah. No, he he does not look uh, healthy at all. But he's, he, you can just see he looks he looks ill, but um, he's yeah. still playing. Yeah, he's playing fine. Yeah, so. yeah. Just not probably just not quite as on point as he normally is. Mm. That is so terrifying. When Ken's hitting your shield, you're just like, "Yep, my shield." With the dying. recent buffs as well. Have you seen uh, Ryu, for example, down <laughs> smash into the down B? Yeah, but that was a very clean stock. Take I really, there. I really want to see like Carrot just bring that out, like some sort of shield break from the buffs. Yeah, that's gonna be a stock. Yeah, and they're even playing Smash Four because we've got around six minutes on the clock and two stocks each. I actually don't remember the Smash 4 rules. It honest. was two stock six minutes. I That's hated awful. It. I hated it. It was awful. Three stocks eight minutes was always the way. But alas, anyway. To be fair, it does sound even worse as like. I mean, it wasn't that. It was just. Anyway, it, it was irrelevant, is what it was. Because <laughs> we're now playing Ultimate. Anyway, um, this game has stayed pretty even most of the way. Like, of course, um, Reese with the percentage lead at the moment that can, a character that can just build up damage just like that and it could have potentially have taken that stock right there and then because he would have just pushed him off the ledge. Right. Oh yeah, I forgot that's a thing. Yeah. I was just thinking he's on 24%, it can't be possible. Oh yes, it can. Um, but Ken's no. got invincibility now on his side B, doesn't he? Is that uh, his foot does, but I was despite say, yeah. that he still has a ton of end lag when done in the air and you see a respect making the most of that. Yeah, I was going to say, because uh, I nearly thought if it, was, if it was like completely invincible, that should be a broken move. Yeah, well, as you saw there, he used it to go through the projectile. That is what it enables these. It enables now. It enables him to go through projectiles with Tatsu. It's probably more effective with Ryu, but, you know, Ken can definitely make use of it himself. And yeah, we've definitely seen, uh, like, people online uh, exploiting more of Ryu, for example. So, but this, it still applies to Ken. Oh, yeah, no, he dropped the shield just at the last minute. But yeah, I mean, Reese has done a fantastic job here of you know, holding it, back it down, up. but that is it. No, it's not. It's not it. it. You never give up. Oh. Oh. <laughs> too, too busy fast falling out of the down tilts. He wasn't ready for the up here. You see, see, you know, one combo only needs another one of those to get the damage all the way back up and have an even game again. Oh, and there we go. Oh, my God. What? Why did he pop off when he it did, didn't? He, he did hadn't gone yet. Oh, he, he loses, he's going to well. be kicking himself. And now he's in a terrible situation. He could just up out anywhere and it could work. Yeah, it's probably, I, probably not I, best to do, though. If I if I was Reese, I would be boarding the goddamn platforms right about now because I don't want to be anywhere near this man on the floor. To be fair, you just don't want to be near Ken in general. I mean, that is true. Is you, don't want to be, you don't want to be anywhere near the character. And that might be it. Oh! Not, not getting it, but just yet. It's keeping him away at least in this advantage. Yeah. There we go. Chase there. <laughs> yeah, chase down that. <laughs> could have been. A, could have brought the game free. Yeah, that is two to carrot, and carrot will be playing the surprise winner semis in Ellen, Ellen, I think, Yeah, who made two upsets on his way here. Doing quite good wins. Yeah. That's